Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to install Git into your Windows operating system and also push your work into the GitHub using the GitBase. So for that, you just need to download the GitBase. So just go to your favorite browser and search for GitBase and just go to this download section and download for Windows. So if you're using Mac OS or Linux, you can use the inbuilt terminal to use the git but for windows you just need to download the git base which works like terminal so once you download this executable file just click on this file and just install this git base so just keep everything default just keep on pressing the next and this will keep everything default and install the git base into your windows operating system so once you install the git bash, just go to the github so if you haven't got github account you can just create the github account so once you create the github account just go to this plus sign here and click on this new repository and let me just call it demo and you can just keep this public or if you want to keep it private you can just choose this private as well but i will be keeping the public and just click on this create repository so this will create the remote repository so once you create this repository let me create one folder here. Let me call it demo. So just type demo. So inside here, I will be creating one text document. Let me call it hello and click enter and write something inside here. This is the demo for Git and GitHub. And let me save this file and let me close everything and just go to this folder and right click here and just click on this git bash here and the first step is to initialize the repository with dot git extension so for that just type git init so this will initialize this repo with dot git so if you are not able to see this you can just click on this view and just click on this hidden item so this will show the dot git extension and once you do that just type git add and dot before that, if you want to check if the file, what are the file that are available to add, you can just type git status. So you can see on the red text here, you can add this hello.txt. So once you add, just type git add. So now again, check git status. You can see here the new file has been added, which is showing in green text. So now once you do this, just type git commit hyphen m and just type first commit. And for the first time, this will ask for the global configuration. So once you do this for the first time, from next time, this won't be asking for the configuration again and again. So for the first time, I will be just typing the git config and just type global user.email and just give the email which you have used for opening your GitHub accounts. So I will be giving my email address here and just type gmail.com and also you need to give the username of your github account so just type git config global user.name and the username so i have the username 8877 so you give your username as well so once you do this so you can just type git commit hyphen m and just type the first commit so this is basically a message, the commit message or the changes which you have done. So since we are doing it for the first time, so I have given the message first commit. So once you do this, just go to this remote repository again and just copy this remote origin line pasting here. And the last step is to push into this remote repository. So for that, just type git push hyphen u origin master. And once you do this, this will ask you to authorize your GitHub account. So just click on this sign in with the browser. So you will be shown with the window to authorize your GitHub account. So just click on this authorize and the authentication will be success. So once you do that, the file will be pushed into the remote repository. So if I just go to this demo again and refresh my remote repository here, so you can see the hello.txt has been already pushed into here and this is pushed by this username which we have said just before and if i just go inside this hello.txt you can see this text which we have written in that file so this is how you install git into your windows operating system and also push your work into the github account 
Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel.